Hey there, what's up YouTube? I'm Extraordinary Jr. and welcome to episode 6 of Pokemon Omega Ruby Egglock. In the last episode, we reached Slateport City and got two new Pokemon, uh, one of which I allowed you guys to name, and that was Pharaoh Seed. Now, this is... Alright, whoever left this comment, good job. Uh, this is a really uh, good nickname. It is a barbed Pokemon, so why not just name it Barbara? Uh, that's... Really good, whoever came up with that, thank you. Uh, two reasons why I like that name, Barb, you know, Barb makes sense, and uh, big Rooster Teeth fan, so I think of puns and Barbara, so that's a twofer. Solid job by you, uh, whoever left that comment. I unfortunately don't remember, but I remember the name, so good job. Uh, also, thing we're going to be going to start doing now, uh, whenever we play, is we're going to be online on the 3DS. Uh, I will be, my name will come up and I'll be online playing, uh, just because I feel like that's nice to, you know, show people that I'm actually on playing and recording. And these Pokemon don't belong in the hall, but whatever. I can move that later. Uh, I need Krabby. Yeah. Macargo, chill. Uh, yeah. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> I said yeah there a lot. So, anyway, moving on more vocabulary. Uh, we can now show the fact I'll be online and just to, uh, you know, let people see. Why not? It's fun. Anyway, we have a lot to do today, and I mean a lot. Uh, this is this is the wrong place. We have we we export Slayport, but we have to not only train, uh, we have to um, deliver some goods. And hang on, how do I how do I pull up my map again? I, I don't know how to pull up the map. Actually, fuck it, whatever. I think it's like that. Yeah, okay. I wanted the map. Okay, good. No, I like having the map up on the bottom screen just so I can see the route. Uh, makes it a little more helpful for me for catching Pokemon and everything like that. So anyway, Route 109, we got a Pokemon on this route. Uh, we can do that. And, uh... We'll catch a Pokemon here, and then we'll start fighting some trainers. So at least we'll have an egg, we'll get an egg above Slateport. And, uh... This might be a gigantic episode, or it might be even split into two parts. Uh, with all the stuff we have to do, honestly. Because it's a ton. It really is a lot of things we have to do. Uh, in this town. And around it. And... Hey Steve, what's up? So it might get split into two episodes to figure out what we have to do and to do everything that <laughs> there is to accomplish here. And or, or it might just be one gigantic episode. I'm not really sure yet. We'll have to see how everything goes. Uh, but we do get a Magikarp there, which is nice. That is another egg for us at level 10. Um, I didn't train up the two Pokemon from last time. I didn't really feel like it. That's just, you know, done over time if I have to. Uh because it just makes it, you know, easier to record. And, um, yeah, if I ever have to, it usually would only take eh, 15, 20 minutes. Not, not that long, but it's just annoying. Anyway, let's fight this guy right here. Probably has water types, uh, so it obviously makes sense to send out Griffin, even though he has a flying type. Makes no sense. Oh, okay, Wingle, I was... I guess I was right. I don't know. Actually, I can't even... Hang on one second. I can't really see... Damn. Okay, contact. Fucking up. Can't see a thing. Always nice. Like being blind. It's a big thing. <laughs> anyway, I, I can't actually see what's going on on the screen. Okay, someone just got a level. I. Alright, someone got a level there. I, I think I'm good. Alright. Ugh, stupid fucking. What the hell, contact? Okay. I, th I think now it's finally okay. <laughs> so someone got a level there. I was not able to see it. Uh, I guess I'll have to, you know, watch it with you guys and see who got the level there. Uh, or I could just look, but... no, oh, hey! half shell level 13. Probably not him. And learning Yawn? No, I don't need that. Uh, anyone else? Nope! Alright, we're good. But there's like six or seven trainers on this route. And we have to beat all of them. Because I need experience. <laughs> uh, are you a trainer? Yeah, this guy is. Alright, this little kid. Right, let's beat up this little kid. We're gonna, we're gonna drown him. We're gonna drown this kid. And when I say that, I actually mean it. Oh, hey. Uh, no, wait. You guys didn't see that. Damn. We got a a message. Like you know how like you could send uh, friends and stuff like a nice uh, on the game if you're online. Yeah, we just got one of those. So maybe being online is completely pointless. Cause maybe I'll 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 know. I'll see it. I guess that counts. But no one else will. <laughs> Oh, well. 
that is. That's not a gigantic deal anyway. It's just not. It's just nice to see. All right, this kid defeated. Um, if I remember correctly, there is a little house somewhere over here that we need to go to, because if you defeat all the trainers, you get some item or something. At least that's what I remember. Not entirely sure. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see. We, we have time. We're on this route anyway. So, Azuril, uh, God, ah, damn, contact, ow. <laughs> this is not funny, actually, it hurts. The fuck? Ow. I'm not wearing glasses. I'm wearing my contacts for now. Ow. Alright, I, I'm not gonna put this... Uh, fucking... Whatever. I, I only need one contact anyway. Skirt. <laughs> We're going half blind. Who needs vision anyway? Except, you know, most people. Most people need vision. It helps. I'll just put glasses on later. Ow. That shit hurts. I'm not sure who else wears contacts. Uh, but if you do, and they fall out, it hurts. Just so you know. Hey! Hey, soft sand. Nice. Oh, can I can I battle another Pokemon on this trainer on this route? Let's see. Is it that thing? Yeah, Ricky wants to battle again. Trainer's eye. Okay. Um. Sick. We'll we'll rebattle Ricky, and we'll we'll actually test it out and see how that goes. So I believe this is Ricky. I think that's Ricky, right? Uh, yeah, it's Ricky. Hey, he wants a battle again. All right. So that, I guess that's how double, uh, double, uh, the, the versus secret now works. I guess it's just random. Uh, that was cool. I'm happy we saw that. It doesn't look like Ricky got any stronger. We're going to get a one hit KO move again with a karate chop, but that's still, uh, helpful. We get experience for it. So I'm not going to complain. If someone knows how the versus secret works, you can, you can, you know, leave a comment. I'll probably read it. Uh, I'm not, I'm not upset. That's cool. Uh, I guess if you just beat a trainer enough, they will want a rematch. Okay. That was nice. Anyone else over here? Oh, what's this? Oh, that's, that's the deck snap. I don't need to look at that. Just some stuff on the bottom half of the screen, guys. Don't worry about it. I was looking. Um, hmm. Okay, sailor guy. He's got a Machop. Yeah, this is a great fucking area for Griffin. Shame is, he's horrible in the next gym. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> oh, well. Um, do we have a ground tip on the team right now? Shit, do we? I don't think we do. Because Pancake was retired. So we don't have a ground tip. I could use, I could use a Geo dude or someone in an egg. That would be convenient to have. So I don't think we have a ground type. Or even ground moves. So this is going to be an interesting gym coming up once we get to Watson. I believe his Pokemon are in the, in the 20s? Maybe it's, maybe his Manetric is like 21. But we'll see. It's not the biggest deal in the world. Let's fight these trainers. Alright. <laughs> I believe this is the Seashore Hut. Or Seashore House. I think this guy said. So if we defeat all the trainers, we get 6 Soda Pop. And then we can buy some. Uh, for I believe 350 each. And those restore 60 HP, which is uh, incredibly helpful. That's like a full restore at this point in the game. And I usually stock up on them and keep them the rest of the game anyway. Kind of like lemonades or moo moo milks or fresh water. Uh, they are cheaper alternative ways of healing. And they're better than the Pokemarts. So you always want to keep track of them. Which I always thought was interesting. I like how uh, Pokemon inspires... Uh, bad business, you know, like, oh, the Pokemarts, hey, you want this, or, not organic, uh, medically made potion that restores your Pokemon life, or you want some water, and the water does more, you know, it's, it's a little weird, so though we're running Aerial Ace, 60 base power, they both are, I'm actually gonna get rid, get rid of Wing Attack, I do like Wing Attack a lot, it's one of my favorite moves, uh, cause it's, it has a lot of PP and it's pretty strong, but Aerial Ace is, is, uh, the same power, but never misses, so... I'll take that, and half shell 14, ah, alright. We're getting stronger, we are. I have to see how Togepi's doing, we have to see if we can evolve him rather soon. Uh, into Togekiss, and Togetic? Is it Togetic and then Togekiss? I believe it's Togetic, then Togekiss, so... I believe they're both, both, uh, based on happiness, I don't believe there's a level. Uh, I will eventually have to look that up, or Google, or... Well, looking it up in Google at the same thing, or look in the comments, but, 
the internet's a great source of information, especially when you don't know anything. It's amazing when you think about it that uh, technology has come to the point now where everything that we know as like a people, as, as people, is available to us by like five clicks. Um, but we use it to look at Reddit, watch Pokemon videos, and and bitch at people if they don't have the same opinions as us. We're good. We're good people. Us, the world. Not 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 complaining by any means, especially if you're watching Pokemon videos, by by some guy named Extraordinary Junior. I hear I heard. He's funny. Oh, you're a battle. Okay. I heard he's funny, and he uh, and he has cool hair. Big fan of my hair. I mean, uh, his hair, obviously. Oh, hey, Goldine. Uh, ooh, actually, have I ever have I ever talked about Goldine? Um, I fucking I hate Goldine. Not not for the fact that's you know bad in games or there's a ton of water types or that Sea King's not the best. Uh. Blame Super Smash Brothers. I am a huge, huge fucking fan of Super Smash Brothers. I love that shit, uh, especially Brawl. Well, not Brawl. Melee. Melee is the is the good one. The go the GameCube one. Uh, big fan. Really good at that game. Not by any means a professional fucking Smash player with L canceling and wave dashing and all and all that uh you know complicated competitive shit. But I'm pretty good at the game. Like when you stick in terms of just people who play the game for fun. Uh, we play it extremely well in my, in, at uh, back home. It's me, my brother, uh, actually two brothers occasionally. My cousin Lenny, who, who we should probably get back in videos again. Uh, my neighbor, it, it's, it's a bunch of us, my friends. Uh, we all love Smash. We all do. And I'm not by any means the best player there. I'm like the third or fourth one out of like eight people. But we're all very good at the game. And... We fucking love, we love Smash so much. Uh, Melee, at least. Not Brawl, and we didn't buy a Wii U, so we don't have that. But, um, Goldeen, in the original Super Smash Brothers, and actually, it might be on Melee, too. Or it might be all of them, actually. I have to think about that. I don't know off the top of my head. Uh, whatever, you, you'd get Pokeballs. Pokeballs would be an item in the game that you could use in, against people. And you would throw it. At least, at least once a game. Maybe twice a game. You throw a Pokeball, bam, Goldeen. What does Goldine do? It splashes. Fuck you, Goldine. And then we started playing Smash without items, and we never had that problem again. But you know what? I remember that. Uh, Goldine, you sick bastard. Um, <laughs> ah, God, Smash is fun. Super Smash Brothers is great. It's funny. Um, I've not played that game in a little while, actually. Since the last time I was home, so that was two weeks ago. But but then before that, I didn't play since September. Wow, and that, and that's a uh, Super Smash Brothers. At least um, at least uh, Melee is over twelve years old. I think it was came out in two thousand one. That game is twelve to thirteen years old, and we still play that shit. It is fucking fantastic. And I I have not bought uh, the Wii U version. I played the demo. Uh, I oh shit. Oh, shit, switch out. Oh, my God. Ooh, Carvana. Dangerous Pokemon. Okay, I got scared to have Pursuit. Oh, God. All right, um... Uh, what was it saying? I was talking about Smash. I have not played the new one, uh, for the Wii U, for the fact of, um, I don't like it. I actually don't. I, I obviously have the 3DS, if you, if you didn't know that, and I, I got the demo... I really didn't think it was good. It wasn't fun to play on on the 3DS. It just, it was, it was okay, I guess. It wasn't anything special. And, um, I didn't spend my money on it. I, uh, I could've. I could've definitely made some videos in it, but I, I didn't, I genuinely did not like it. It was just kind of boring. It, it, it's not the same playing on, on that five inch screen. Uh, as opposed to a 50-inch with four people gathered around on a GameCube and, oh, hey, Tokui's evolving. Nice. Um, but it's different, you know? And it, it was not fun. And the buttons were different, I think. It was just not that enjoyable. But anyway, now we'll see Togetic or Togekiss. I believe it's Togetic. Uh, uh, hey, it's Togetic. Hey, nice. All right. He likes me. Cool. We, we made Togepi happy. 
now I have to look up Togekiss eventually. Let's check out uh, Half Half Shell's new levels and stuff. All right. I mean, he's still slow. He's still kind of weak, but he is a special attacker, which makes extra sensory pretty good. All right. I uh, I'm happy. I, I'm definitely happy with that. I'm happy that he likes me. So let's. Uh, I believe we're done with all the trainers. Let's talk to this guy. I'm the owner of C C Shore House. You can call me Mr. C. What I love about is the hot Pokemon battles. Let's see if your heart burns hot. Okay, I think we defeat all the trainers, right? Uh, yeah, there we go. All right, we got the soda pop. Sick. And then we can uh. Oh, uh, do I have to buy him like that? All right, yeah, I'm not gonna bother with that then. Not right now. We're not gonna buy him in that slow ass way. If you can buy like a dozen or like a half dozen at a time, I'd like that more. But I'll pass on that. Uh, whatever. That was cool. We got battle. I was gonna say battle heralds. Uh, done. But we got seashore house. Uh, okay. I can live with that. Let's heal, and then we will go up to route 110. I want to say. And then we will deliver the Devon ports. So we're getting stuff done today. We're, we're moving around. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> ah. Okay. <laughs> I'm alright. Let's head up to... Oh, I actually have to buy some items. I have to buy some Pokeballs real quick. We're running out. And I've been using Premier Balls. Which is just weird. Alright, so let's buy... Uh, buy 13 Pokeballs. Get a Premier Ball. Buy... Uh, Buy 13 Great Balls. Oh, hey, you got Premier Ball 2 for that? Nice. Um, can't use Revives. So I'll buy some Antidotes while I'm here. Really? No Antidotes? I didn't have any Antidotes? That's that's a little bad. We'll stack up on all these. We'll buy 5 of each. Awakenings, yes. Uh, it's funny. I, I always buy, like, Burn Heals and Ice Heals. I've, I've probably been frozen it twice, ever, uh, in Pokemon, and Burn maybe, you know, a few times. Never much. But there we go. Uh... I'll buy a few repels just in case. I'll buy ten for later. So future me, uh, we got some repels. You're welcome. Uh, ten episodes ahead, David. Uh, by the way, looking looking good that day, man. Even though it makes no sense for me to say that, even though it's true, uh, because ten day ten episodes later, David will probably not be seeing this. So yeah. Anyway, we're gonna one ten. Okay, cool. Um, let's let's use uh, let's use half show. I don't think you're gonna kill Pokemon. I really hope you don't. So let's use Half Shell and see what you can do uh, against the Pokemon around 110. Here we go! First Pokemon encountered is a... Hey, it's an Electric. Alright, I like you, bud. How's it going? Uh, level 11. Alright. Uh, Metronome. Well, let's just see. Please don't kill the Electric or yourself. Half Shell goes with... Earthquake! Oh, shit! Ah, you dumb fuck! God damn it! Aww. Aww. You fucking... Ow! You dumb shit, half-shell. Bitch. Alright, whatever. No Pokemon at 110. Aww. Damn it! <laughs> I'm actually sad. God fucking... Argh. Idiot. Uh, let's... I guess we can go do a con... No, we can't do contest. We have to go deliver this shit first. Half Shell, you're too strong. Take a seat. Chill. Uh, we're actually... We've always used Griffin a bit, so let's go with Krabby. Let's... Let's... let's stick with Krabby. Plus, we're gonna fight Team Magma anyway. So we'll... We'll, uh, use our water type. Let's go deliver the Devon Goods. I believe... The shipyard... Is back this way. It's, uh... I think it's right here. If I remember right. Hey, guys. What's up? Yeah, I think this is it. Uh, that goes here, and that goes over there. Then where does that thing go? And what about this doohickey? Ah, I can't make heads or tails of this. Well, it's not a coin, so, you know. Hmm, you. Oh, sorry, I'm Doc. I thought you were a dick. Okay. Captain Saren commissioned me to draw up designs for a fairy. All those parts you have, those are Devon parts. But, um, this won't do. Because Captain Saren's probably at the Oceanic Museum again. Alright, well, let's go to the museum. We gotta learn. Kids, we're going to the museum! Yay! You have to pay. Aww. Also, it's a museum. 
Aww. Even if there's a Pokemon museum, I'd, I'd probably be happy. I'd probably be okay with that. Excuse me. Go through reception. All right. Ocean Museum. Entry fee is 50 bucks? Yeah, all right. Whatever. Cool. Hey, guy. What's up? Secret that I... It's a secret that I don't... I stopped the reception because I didn't have 50 bucks. Oh, whatever. Hey, Magma guy. Uh, oh shit, they actually try to teach us stuff. No! Don't teach me! This is Pokemon. I can't learn. How dare you? Ah, they're trying, to, they're trying to use that education thing on me, bro. I feel like one of these guys gives me something. Give me something! Ah, ha, what are you doing here? Me, I'm Team Mag- I'm the Team Magma member you thumped before, remember? Here. Alright, got the Alright, so he gave me stuff. I'm okay with that. Now, get the fuck out. Later, guy. It's a fossil with wavy ridges on it. Uh, da 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 Nope. Rubber ball is expanding and shrinking. In the sea, the weight of water itself exerts pressure. No! Stop teaching! God damn it, Pokemon. You're not educational. You are Pokemon. You are fun. I'm guessing that's a map. Hmm... Uh, submarine, submarine, I'm on a boat, I'm on a boat. I guess you're Captain Stern. What's up, guy? Yes? If you're looking for Stern, that would be me. Ah, oh, those are the parts I've ordered from Mr. Stone at Devon. Alright. And then, oh no, the magma grunts. I had no idea you were here. Even though I literally just talked to all of you. <laughs> uh. There they are. They're special. Anyway, uh, Magma Grunt, one Pokemon, has a Numble. And now we begin the trend of what I like to call Krabby getting a lot of screen time. Team Magma loves their Numbles. They are four times super affected by water types. Krabby is a water type. He's going to get a ton of levels against all of Team Magma. And they have Zubats, they have other shit too, but let's be honest, it's mostly Numbles. We're going to be very okay with Krabby. For a while. And that grunt was defeated. <laughs> this one might have a number one Zubat up next. The second guy. And, uh... There we go. Let's see. I'm gonna say number one Zubat. Maybe another Pokemon. I doubt it, though. He's got two. Snoop hey, Zubat! You know what? I'm probably right, too. Uh, and if I am, it was honestly a complete guess. But they are pretty predictable. Uh, and it's just fun to fuck with them. So, Bubble Beam... You know, bubbles. Bubbles will kill you. Uh, oh, won't kill that one. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, oh, oh ugh. I taste what I eat for breakfast. Oh, that's weird. <coughs> oh, that's not enjoyable. Hey, what's enjoyable is seat up to level 19. And learning, and learning worry seat. What the hell is that? See that causes worry is playing on target, prevents sleep by making the target's ability. What? Why would I ever want. Oh, it makes the target's ability inside. I guess that's good. If I like abilities. Pfft, who needs that? that? That'd be good on, uh. On, uh, Slack Off. Slack King. Hey, the number, I was right! Hey, I called that! I'm so good at games, right? Oh, we'll get this one. <laughs> We're good at Emerald and Ruby and Sapphire. That, that's that's what counts, folks. So, number one is defeated. And we look like a badass. Good job, me. Good job. So, that grunt was obviously uh, no match for me. And, alright. How could a future Ace Grunt of Team Magma be defeated? Alright, well, you guys are shitty. And I think this is Maxi. Hey, it's Maxi. What's up, guy? Hey, I don't think we fight you. Now here I am. now here I was wondering how could you be held up by a simple act of seizing a case? By taking your being st st stymed? Stymed by this child? Hmm. There you are, but a child. Your eyes tell me you are you tell me of your fierce determination. And my fierce determination not to learn how to read English. Heart is pounding in my chest. 
Uh, I guess I can think of... I can see why my little grunts cannot stand one minute against you. I'm called Maxi. Not from Soul Calibur. Why does everyone tell me that? I just have nunchucks. And some hair. Black hair. And... And... Good nunchuck skills. Are you one of the few people... Young peoples... Who may shape our society's future? Consider that fact that shall educate you in the ways of the world. The land is the stage upon which humanity stands. That the land exists so we humans might continue onward and upward, stepping into the future. Ah, education, bro. Come on. You can't teach me. All right. Well, I think he. I think he's leaving. Hey, hey he left. I mean, uh, that will that will teach you, you dumb oldie. Old people. Young man! Ah, yeah, David, was it? It's quite a tense situation. Thank you for helping me out. I guess I almost forgot to tell you that you brought these parts from Devon. Yep, take your shit. Take it and leave. Alright. He, he, hey, 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 you listened to me and left. Alright, so we did a lot today. We're not done just yet. I want to see if we can do the Pokemon contest. I do want to... I do want to get the Pikachu. Uh, the cosplay Pikachu for another egg, which is level 20. So, yeah. So let's uh let's try again. Let's go to the contest hall. If not, then I mean I get it. But I want to believe that we can do the contest. Hey little kid, give me shit. Okay, never mind. You you suck. All right. Well, let's try one more time. Maybe the maybe the weird bitch will be in here now. Uh, you don't have a contest pass. Uh, why don't you try sightseeing different places? I am sightseeing! I don't know where to go! God damn it, where is this blue-haired bitch? And I hope she's blue-haired. Or a bitch! I don't know! I want to say she is blue-haired. I, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I've honestly looked around because I really want to do this contest, which is the first and only time you ever hear me say that, uh, because I want the Pikachu. I doubt she'd be in the harbor area. No, she's not here. Uh, alright, whatever. Uh, we get an egg. So, let's grab my cargo and an egg, and we will be back with an egg hatching. So, yeah, we'll call it a day after that. So, uh, you know the deal. See you guys in one second.